when, so, so New Yorkers, just be wise. From, from your ear, big calamity come in, you just be ready. Have your emergency bag ready. Anybody remember the emergency bag or evacuation bag? And you got to go over those stuff, what and what should be in it, you know, a little money and a little emergency stuff, a little, a little food, a little uh, 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 um, first aid stuff, a little, a little stuff, you know, not, not in a big brief um, suitcase, just a little bag. Because you can't run with suitcase. <laughs> Let me edit out these parts. Because it's going to be shown to the world, cause, you know. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. you have a little emergency bag. Remember, brethren, don't these things sound light? Remember when we told you about storm coming and Sandy came? Yes. You remember? You know, anybody remember Sandy? Yes, it came. You know, people were prepared. Amen. Glory to God. So just be ready. Be ready. But there's something very grim. And that's why I'm, I'm hitting to New York. New York is an evacuation prison. I got to tell you that. This stuff I'm telling you, know, my wife and myself, we hardly slept in the past. 36 hours, we're working on this thing, because we're responsible for people, you know, and so we, 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 we got to be there, and we, we have been going through all the details of New York, which road go west, which road go north, which road go east, I'm telling you, how, how, how quick they can come from Long Island, who live in Long Island, who come from um, Brooklyn and, 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 and Queens, I'm telling you, we have been going through that, and, and uh, if you don't believe me, maybe I have, see a copy of one here, these are the main roads out of New York. Right here. And they put on the bottom, you know, in case, you know, God take me first. You know, if you find it again. Travel to the Bronx towards the Birmingham Bridge, 184. Direct possible route. Take 195 to 180, I-91. You see it? You see it? You see it? No, because... No, no, we don't, we don't play with that. I know folks want to disregard stuff. We don't disregard stuff. You're not going to be paranoid. You're not going to be anxious and whatever, but you're just ready. Is that you're ready for heaven? You just be ready. So if there's anything like this happen, anything like this happen, there's a problem. New York is a prison. You cannot get out of New York, go west, unless you go through Washington Bridge or that bridge on, in Manhattan that, that, that you go under the water. What do they call it again? The tunnel, or you go up to Tapanzi Bridge and go and go west. Now, with eight million people living in New York, you know you're not gonna go through. God, this is real. This church gotta be real right here. We're not gonna give you any fallacy. Come on, come on. You know, you, you so you, you have to have a different plan. Cause everybody can't go through Washington Bridge. Come on, it's gonna be jammed. Even if you all walk, it's gonna be jammed. Get away, you take Washington Bridge, take I 80. Well, well, let me go over. Take I 95, that's cross Bronx Expressway. I 95, go north towards New Jersey, go over Washington Bridge, take I 80. Take I 80 and take I 80 all the way through Pennsylvania, all the way to Ohio, and don't stop until you, you, feel, you feel you're safe. What kind of church is this? Come on. Now, the other way is when you get to I-80, you know, and, and you want to, to still stay in New York, you, 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 you switch to I-380, to I and it takes you to, to I-81, <laughs> then to Binghamton. So you're still in, in, in New York. I'm your considering to plant a church in Binghamton. Consider it. <laughs> no, you, you got to get the tape. Okay, it's recorded. Don't worry about it. Yeah? So, but watch it now. But most likely, I'm telling you straight up now, we can't get through the tunnel, nor Washington Bridge, nor Tapanzi Bridge. Yeah, nothing may happen before 10 years, but you can't say you were not ready. And New York is a prison. And New York is so sinful like it's just sinful, we don't realize that we are in a prison. If anything big happen, we can't run. Have you ever noticed that? If anything big happen here, we have no way. We are like a big stadium with three doors. I've never heard that before, but that's a fact. New York is a stadium with eight million people in there with three doors out. So you have to know what you're doing. 
So, you know, uh, so I call that another item of the end time alerts. 